uh, gears a little bit, someone was asking what the point of world unification was, and their context was if we can build one of your great cities in a specific area with enough resources, can we just isolate that city? Wouldn't that be okay? Well, I don't know that it should be isolated. They'd be interconnected by monorail, all of the cities. So you take a monorail from the center of the city, and you emerge at the center of the next city, and then you take a circumferential elevator that will take you circumferentially anywhere in the city, up and down, vertically, horizontally, in any direction, so you don't need cars in the city, which makes it much safer, conserves energy, and makes it more convenient. If there was a sustainable city built with walls around it and it was doing well and everybody lived well in it, but the outside, the values stayed the same and they were still making wars and bombs and people were still hungry and there was an economic downturn, you can be assured that that city would be bombed or be invaded for its goods. You can't live alone anymore. Everything's connected today. If, if, um, if we dump uranium dust in Iraq, it gets floated over to Europe. That's what happened. So you, you really, it's really a global system that we have to go after where everyone lives well. I agree. And uh, one other thing I would probably add is that the resources of the planet are in every country and every territory, and uh, these countries have to learn to share their resources. Therefore, there has to be a global system as well, just from that physical standpoint, I would think, too. Right. Of course. 